7 and you can see that tomorrow Low midless to punt road david Larden with today's developments Richmond's football manager Doug Vickers and St Kilda coach Stan Alves caught the same plane to Adelaide today to watch the SANFL semi-finals. Alves isn't ready to concede Lockett is a lost cause. Tony may have not made that decision and it may have just come through a, a manager doing what he perceives to be his, his role. Late uh, last night Tony rang me and uh, said I'm going to give it away with St Kilda. I said don't be premature with your thinking Tony, what about thinking about it again? He said, OK, thought about it for another half hour and said, no, that's it. St Kilda President Andrew Plimpton is angry Lockett chose to sever his ties with the club I via the media. Uh, I wish that Tony would come and speak to uh, us in the club about it and uh, not do it by public debate. Sydney's offer is the most lucrative, but yesterday Richmond made a late bid. That offer is believed to fall in between St Kilda's $750,000 and the one million being put up by the Swans. But like Sydney, the Tigers' deal is unconditional. Certainly Richmond have... They're pretty keen to get turning. Collingwood has also thrown its hat into the ring, although has yet to put anything in writing. However, Richmond officials privately believe the Magpies are their main rivals to secure Lockett. David Loudon, 7 Nightly News.